Good morning, afternoon, and evening, everyone. This is Hippie Tesla, and tonight we're resuming our adventures in uh, Just to be Obliterated, Raccoon City. Uh, we're resuming Resident Evil 3 Nemesis on easy mode, very, very slow playthrough, touching everything, trying everything I think I haven't tried before, having Nemesis zzz, zzz, falling from the sky, stuff like that. Uh... I kind of didn't want to enter here, I wanted to enter at the main menu, but I forgot to turn off the cam. So now we have some blue space here. Um, well, let's just pretend that this is normal. Uh, yeah, this is very normal. Hello, C-Word. Thank you for interrupting my awkward gag. Thank you so much. You saved me, I owe you one. No, no, never. Never, 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 never. It's okay, thank you for dropping by, that means a lot. Let's go into, uh, have I put the memory card? Yeah, okay. Let's go into, oh, wait, wait, this is not biohazard. Resident that. <laughs> Now, what was the last I was doing? I was repairing that goddamn trolley, tr tram, train, whatever it is. Yeah, let's do that. Let's repair the trolley, tram, train, whatever it is. The TTT. Ooh, nice way to start with this music. They can't stop my last escape because I can save my game. Whenever I die, I just respawn at the last typewriter. How did Raccoon City have this? typewriter secret you ask well nobody really knows we just realize that when we die we can just like load our save okay where's the map it's l2 l2 here i'll keep pressing the triangle playing too much outbreak so we want to go to the substation that is not a subway station that it's a power substation it's gonna be uh drain demons there and we have 77 <laughs> freeze rounds so we can play with nemi as long as we want from this point like as soon as you have 30 of them you won on easy mode especially something gonna jump out and scare me the bra yep never oh wait that's not the, the same gun sir you should no you died too fast grenade rounds why yes i will can i mix them with something what was it uh mixing grenade rounds with something was it the C or CC, you know what? I'm just gonna safely dump these into the item box and I don't need more for now, so uh, yeah. We okay. Ah, this is kind of like PlayStation 1 controller cables, or at least PS1, the white ones, they're um. They're shorter than the PS2 cables, and it shows because my setup was made for like the PS2 cables, and now when I I really gotta be careful. This is the furthest my controller will go. <laughs> okay, look at that. That's so not fair to these guys. Why why would I even carry the shotgun? I just just grenade everything. Just be grenade Joe. That's what I'm gonna do the second half of the game. Yeah, I'm just gonna grenade shit. I didn't even check if there was anything else in the car. I wonder which which police officer had the grenade rounds on them, uh, but not the grenade launcher. It sounds like Harry was here, or maybe Dorian. He saw the barricade of that car and was like, fuck that. I, you know, fuck the grenade rounds. I'm just running away. Barricades, they're scary. I should know. I'm Dorian. The barricade. Look at this. Barricades ever. That, yeah, he would have been spooked here royally. Okay. At least there were some doors. I guess he can use doors. Hmm. You know what I didn't do, do do properly and I wanted? More Drain Demas? No? Uh, I wanted to play Outbreak as uh, Kevin. Uh, I wanted to play actually uh, Desperate Times as Kevin and talk to all the police officers because I noticed they, you know, talk differently to Kevin and even those that wouldn't talk to the other civilians, I think, they will talk to Kevin. 49 is that like seven times seven yeah i want to do all the live reloads so uh, uh going down i guess Pew. oh those vibrations they don't make them like this anymore Pew. now it's gonna be either zombies drain demons or nemesis neither oh hello ma'am may i offer you a new hat 
It's an invisible head. Oh, ha, ha. Hello. Ja. Badass. What? You think you two are gonna stop me? Like, did you even see what happened to those guys? A new hat. That's what happened. Ah! <laughs> and for people who reload live and don't count their bullets, that's what happens to them. Hello. At least they don't cling like an outbreak. God forbid resistance. So this should be locked, yeah. How does this even work? Where am I in relation to the rest of this? How what how is there a whole town underneath? Why is why are those streets so high up? And how how does this work in terms of like traffic? So if you look here at the map, once it loads, you will see that this is a perfectly good street, right? And it goes up here and it ends up as the restaurant. And this whole bit is elevated. But this bit here is like in a hole, so I guess this goes up and this is some kind of a overpass or something. I don't get it. Underpass, triple pass, multiple pass, little Dallas multipass, that's what it is. Do you have a file, sir? Bullets? Okay, yeah, I will just take them hoping you have a file. No, you screwed me over, I don't want your bullets. Oh, fuck your bullets, I'm not gonna use them. Never mind, I'm just gonna hold my stomach. And keep running. Uh, trash, 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 trash. This street looks interesting. Like, it looks like more, we could see more here. But I can't even see what happened there. Is that a van? Or, like, a construction thing fell on him? Or do barricades in Raccoon City just fall from the sky? Look at that over there. What is going on in this picture? Anything here? No, we can't even go there. There's a little barricade on the floor. These these rebar? No, what are they? Okay. And look, there's a building there. There's a there's a oh I never noticed there's a bulldozer or like construction thingy. Yeah, it's here. Doesn't want to comment on it. There's a whole power plant underneath the streets. Like what where is the street I came from? It should be right here. It's like on top of this thing. Is that the highway? Is it somehow connected to the highway highway overpass from a uh, outbreak? Tell me more, I want to know. Ooh, a special metal gate with a special metal sound. It means it's gonna be badass. Hello? 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 Nobody here? I know you're gonna be here later. Do I have the room for this shit? I have four slots. I hope that's enough. Should be. There's gonna be a silly puzzle here. I remember it's something to do with voltage. So this one opens with... High voltage control room. The lock will be released at 115 to 125 volts. And over here we have a low voltage control room. The lock will be released at 15 to 25. I don't know why those voltages and what the fuck can you do with 15 to 25 volts in a power plant? No idea. Over here we have an override switch that will be useful later. Okay. Oh, well, not for now. Okay. There should be... Oh, there's nothing here. This is lock. Locked. Lock? This is lock? I meant this is locked. Alright, and we have transformer. Auto mode. So, yeah. Automatically, it doesn't do what it... <laughs> doesn't do jack shit. You just gotta set it to manual and type it in. That's why in Raccoon City, they need people to work in the, their... It's not a power plant. It's more like a power distribution center. Okay, so let's open the... Which one do we want to open first? I'm gonna say... Hmm. Hmm. Let's think about it. Let's open the low voltage one first, I guess. Because I'm gonna be running away from here. So I can either fry their heads or run away. I don't know what to do. Let's think. Uh, this is not my decision day. Or let's say, yeah, this is going to be uh, blue, red, blue. Oh, that's nothing. Blue. Yep, just blue, 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 blue. Nothing happened because the voltage is like not up to snuff. <laughs> Maybe it's losing electric pressure. Monica was up to something. So let's say blue, 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 blue. Okay, it's not a silly puzzle or it is. 
and I'm just not doing it properly. Okay, then I'm going to bet my ass it's going to be blue, a blue, a red. Oh, fuck, blue. Okay, it's blue, 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 red, isn't it? Okay, once more. We need low power gel. Or let's just set it to 125 volts and fuck with it. Blue, 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 red. Okay, red, blue, blue, blue. I am beginning to feel overpowered by this silly puzzle. Okay, red, blue, blue. Yeah, that is, that's it. There we go. Ooh. 15 to 20 volts. What do you power with that exactly? Vehicles? Ve car battery chargers? I mean, elevators here run on car batteries, which are like 12 to at most 24 volts, but those look like 20, 12 to 16 volts. And somehow they work. Oh, gee. They're knocking. No, I'm not home. So we have a fuse. It says a fuse for the high power supply t to be used with large machines machinery okay how does that work like how why was it in the low power room these like you know resident evil is great when it gets to these technical puzzles they sometimes it's just confusing like how the fuck do you even power the elevator an elevator with a car battery this it's, i don't know it's like powering a car with a double a you know it doesn't work hello unknown it's been a while yeah, I haven't mentioned, so... Oh my god, yeah, they scared me. After this scene, let's fry their heads or escape and then, like, shotgun them to death. Hmm. 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 Nobody's voting. Hmm. I have very little time. I think I'm gonna go to the emergency exit and then come back and just fuck them up. Yeah, let's do that. This is like the precursor to outbreak door opening and the later resistance. Rawr! Strong gel runs. You've opened the lock. No, I didn't. You did it. Would you stop, stop, you know, transferring your stuff onto me, Jill. Jeez. Now we're gonna have the stars. I think. Stars. I know. You can't even see them through the fucking grate. I know you're there. You're just invisible while I'm not in the room. <laughs> No nemesis? Oh, this is... Yeah. Maybe if I blasted their heads, they would have been... Hmm. 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 Yeah, this is the gray launcher. I'm not wasting it on you. I did, but that's one you get. I'm not giving you any more. Hello, boys. Oh, just like two zombies. Are you serious? That's why you ran away? Invisible hat. Oh, Jill. That's disappointing. I thought it's like an army of zombies there waiting for me. It's just two guys. Busted the door for nothing. Imagine if the city wasn't... Oh, there they are. Oh, they learned to open the doors. Oh, that's new trick. Let's blast them horizontally. Anyone else? Sir, I can see you. And there's one probably in the room. I don't like your face, so I'm going to give you a new hat. There you go. Invisible hat. Anyone else there? No, stop. In the name of law. Thank you. Anyone here? No. Okay, let's open the other room. Still nothing hit there. <laughs> yeah, with this much detail. Hey, but you have drained Demas that, that you have to vomit out, so you would be thankful for that. <laughs> I know. I mean, I still kind of enjoy the remake, but compared to... I was mostly... Mostly my, my, my gripe is like nobody mentioned it, as far as I've heard, but it's the fucking hunters, they're ugly. Alpha hunters. Gammas were never my favorite, but I respect them. But then you have alpha hunters, and or whatever they are, I think they're hunters are. No, they're beta hunters. Yeah. Beta hunters in the remake, just like, why? It looks like a rabid dog. No. <laughs> And it's, you know, switching some of these. The, the power station in the remake is so boring. This is this is way more fun. Even though it's a silly puzzle that I failed to do, which we'll not mention again. I'm going to go ooh, so close. It was It's blue, blue, red, red. Blue, blue, red, red. This is way more fun than running around in the dark, puking out little bugs, you know, at least to me. I mean, I have a gripe with fleas and Resident Evil in general. The outbreak fleas, the 
Okay. Uh, hmm. The outbreak rolling fleas are the highest offenders. I will never let that go. So let's see. Uh, then we go. Oh, this is gonna jump high, so I'm gonna go blue and then red. It's the same thing. Okay. Then let's try. Hmm. I wonder how I do this if it weren't a silly, silly puzzle. High, high, and then blue. There we go. There we go. Blue. Open. I, you know what? I can forgive that Jill didn't get to RPD. It's like, you know, putting Carlos there. I get what we're, they were trying to do. And seeing how the thing exploded, like the boiler wall that's missing in Resident Evil 2, those connections, those were pretty cool. Oh, another Magnum. Yippee. But it was still kind of half-assed, and the only fair liquor that you see is there. I think that's the only liquors you see are in the RPD. That makes no sense. You know, why, why they're not in the hive thingy? And why are the hunters ugly? And why why wouldn't Jill and Carlos be like, Carlos, like, oh, there's something at the police station. Uh, let's go there together. And they go together. You know, anything. It's kind of, they try to make it cool, but they kind of tripped on their own thoughts, I think. So, the idea was good, but they kind of, kind of, yeah, clock tower. Nobody forgave the clock tower for, oh my god. It's not even like, it's not even, it's not even as, I think, uh, the first Resident Evil movie, not having a Spencer mansion, and, you know, not following the games in general. Is that all just a magnum? I want some fucking gunpowder. That's why I'm still running around here. Uh, I think, you know, this, this was way worse received. Everybody, from day one, the first criticism I heard was, where the fuck is the clock tower, Capcom? You think this is a motherfucking game? You know, everybody just, I get it, again, but they, they show it there in the distance, they're like, yeah, you know, that's the clock tower, too bad you're not going there. They were trying something new, but it didn't work out, as we've seen. In my opinion, even Resident Evil 2 Remake falls flat in some areas where A and B scenarios are just, they're not there. You're just playing the same thing with another character. Ooh, they started behind the Raccoon Police Department. Big deal, you know. It, it was much better in the original, in my opinion, and but I love the tyrant, and I almost like love the nemesis in the remake, but he's not there. He's just, it just appears sometimes to be like stars. Oh wait, I have to go do this other thing because this is a cutscene, and I can't kill you in the cutscene. And then the final battle with him, it was kind of re redeeming. I know Jill fired a fucking railgun <laughs> like it's a pistol, but that's Resident Evil. See, that that kind of stuff, that kind of weird stuff is good, but then, you know, taking away key locations, people don't react good to that. They they grew up with those locations. They want to see it. I wanted to, um, I honestly, I wanted to see more of the city. It was just like 15 minutes in the city. Let's go to the subway, hospital, game over. That's it. What? Where's the city? I wanted to explore Raccoon. You didn't give us enough in Resident Evil 2 Remake. It was like there, but not really. Uh, there's the city. Uh, too bad you gotta get in. You know, you gotta get to the, the RPD. Uh, but then in, in the B scenario, you don't even see the city. <laughs> it's like, this happened. We skipped to the RPD. Yeah. Like, this, uh, Resident Evil 3, for me, like this first half, when you're running around, yeah. Yeah, there's two, I'm going to say two crossroads. <laughs> but this, like running around, looking at this, you know, this it's just like a piece of shopping district. But I can see what their life was from this. You know, you can kind of catch the atmosphere. You can see, like, you can imagine this being lively. I don't know, mother with children running to work, cutting through the shopping center because map loading. Because, you know, it was too far to go around the main street. So, like, let's cut through the sh shopping center. Mother works, I don't know, in the fucking substation, whatever this is. Yeah, I don't know. You know, and there's a school somewhere here that we don't see. Whatever. I imagine stuff like that. But Remake doesn't give me that. You know, it's dark and, yeah, the architecture is there. But I don't know how to... If I just play those games, I would just think, you know, this could have been, like, a suburb of New York City. You know, it doesn't mean... It doesn't have that flavor. Yeah, I don't even remember what happened in the... Yeah, in the remake, you kind of just have a nightmare. And fuck off with nightmares already. I mean, they're not tricking anyone. But at least, especially in an, in an 
you know in a remake game where we know like 80 percent of audience knows what's gonna happen and like haha first person game you are alone you're turning into some no i'm not i mean i know this is resident evil 3 just like stop it <laughs> uh did we leave a place for the uh let's see one two three yeah i was smart enough uh, we take these, we drop these, for fuck's sake, nobody needs that many bullets. I, would, I can just throw it at them, like in hot shots. Will I need another... You know what? I know this is easy, but I'm also rusty. Let's take another mix. Yeah, I have plenty. Because there's also going to be the giant worm of death. And we have everything we need for Nemi. This is this is good. As Nikolai says in, in, in Resistance, this this is good <laughs> okay no reason to save or anything ah my eye what the fuck like someone shot me in the eye okay uh that's it we have the fuse we will repair that tram while all the men are doing a running around <laughs> chasing with them is now i'm sure N nikolai has an important mission <laughs> Hmm, that's, uh, that's, you know, Capcom's focus is obviously different now, but since RE4 is what started all of this, excuse me, all of this, like, this new gameplay of uh, Resident Evil, I guess it's possible, it could be expected, I don't know, it could be expected to be good, they don't have to tweak much, mostly just, like, make it in the new engine and, you know, higher resolution, probably uh, the RE engine god knows you don't have to do much with that game you know you don't have to transform it from static angles into static camera angles to like a game you already have everything you need just like redo it it was widescreen it already ran it was the first i mean it was one of the rare uh, playstation 2 games that ran on the 480p I'm not, I'm not thinking like do the same Resident Evil 4. I just think, you know, like if. I guess it was easier for Final Fantasy 12, which I often use for this this kind of comparison. But. It's something like that, you know. <laughs> well, Capcom's Capcom. My stomach hurts. Anybody got any stomach medicine? Hello? No? Oh, sorry, I'm turning fast. I have this stick. When I'm walking, I just have to suddenly turn. Ooh. Okay. Anyone on the counter? Untidy. Ew. I don't want to touch that. I've taken those from there, I think. Yeah, that's why I didn't have some of those. So, as soon as I step there, something's going to happen, right? Hello? Yep. Maybe I should have got... <gasps> it's Nikolai, not Carlos. Different stuff. Fuck yeah. I didn't check the garage. Did he say, I'm going to check here? I don't remember this cutscene. Because, again, this is... I remember somehow through the fog, I think my first or second playthrough, which was like two year 2000, June. I'll tell you exactly, about 15 June. I remember these things. When I first played this. Hello? Oh, we're touching our shoulders. Mm. Hello, Nikolai. I think this, when I, the last time I did it like this. Hello, Nikolai. No, she doesn't care. Oh, look, he's getting up. He's gonna actually explore. That's kind of stuff. Didn't have that in RE2. RE2. You gonna help me, Nikolai? It's like, watch around. It's just a gas station, man. There's nothing here. Or is there, Nikolai? You got something to tell me? Huh? No, don't don't ignore me. I have a shotgun. I can shoot up and down and turn without moving my feet, apparently. <laughs> I forgot about that. Can you? No, you can't return with the aim. <laughs> yeah, that's that's actually a good idea. Painting equipment also burns fast. Uh, Nikolai, could you just wait there for about five to ten minutes? No, Jill, I know it's so good machine oil. I have a lighter. I wish. If... Maybe I should check. People probably check. You can just like soak it with a. I mean, light it with a lighter. Okay, let's do that puzzle. Fuck. Do I want this? No. Why would I want it? Is there a file on this? I kind of feel there should be a file on like how to operate our oil coolant thingy. You have to press the buttons until the puzzle puzzle is solved. Welcome. Maybe it's maybe I take the spray. 
maybe it's behind there I'm gonna mix the oil anyway so it doesn't matter nice bass there in the music Nikolai did you take the file you son of a bitch Big, give me my file is there a file maybe there isn't maybe I just maybe I already took it actually I didn't I couldn't have mechanics memo manager yeah nothing's much happening with the files I guess it starts over from the clock tower Okay, I guess we open it. Nikolai, stay there. I'm just gonna check this oil thingy. And then things might happen. Things I have no control over. Okay, let's maintain it. So we wanna... What? We wanna put them all four together, right? Yes. Uh, no. I'm gonna say yes. Yes. There we go. And then B. Uh, then this... Actually, this... No. They need to be different. You need to be... Aha! Uh -huh. Turn off this and then do this. Yes. Let's be again. It's not like giving me a challenge. Unlike the silly puzzle. So I want to switch them with... C, B, D... D sure, why not? E this actually this one flips those right so i want it to be there but i want it to be those two okay i want it to be no i want it to be here and i want it to be here and then here no and then here and then here no and then here there we go What a password. <laughs> Anybody with five spare minutes could unlock this. <laughs> Storage to maintain the temperature level of the oil. Nothing seems to be useful here. Okay, so we have machine oil, which is oil for small machines. Can be used for the large size machinery by itself. Then we have the additive. This is just like handling a, uh, what's it called? A, a lawn mower. Lawn mower. Okay, then we combine them and we make mixed oil okay now we have everything uh nikolai wait just a second i'll be right back nope guess not did you do that you asked me. oh yeah no it's okay we don't oh he'll be okay <laughs> so if i wait here will it explode <laughs> She's like, uh, you know what? Fuck Nikolai. I'm just gonna. I'm not even gonna. Goodbye, Nikolai. <laughs> he didn't deserve, deserve even that. One of my favorite cutscenes. Things start exploding. Shaboo! The Michael Baying intensifies. <laughs> Jeez, that's a lot of distortion in that explosion. Wow, good thing I had my volume down, it would have torn my ears through. Phew! Yeah, I would be sweaty after that too. It's gonna fire it around, I remember. <clears throat> yeah. That's really cool. I know it's like RE3 started Michael Bane. Like, that's where the series started doing that. And you know what, it was always explosive at the end, but this is like all through the game. And of course, Outbreak picked it up. Code Veronica 2, there's a lot of explosions. But this is kind of, this kind of goes with the scene, what just happened. And it's like small explosions still happening. Buildings somehow, surrounding building unskated. The artist was founded. <laughs> How did he survive that? Because he's a sur supervisor. You should know better. <laughs> I am one of the soup. He, not even his clothing is gonna be burned, I swear. And I, I we'll see when, when we meet him. Hello, Nami. I know you're gonna hide there. If you're even gonna hide with that bazooka of yours. I could... Stars. Oh, he's not even gonna have a bazooka? Just like punches? Yeah, this is like the best place to fight. A boo, asshole. Oh, one for one. Yeah, just keep dodging. Oh, no, okay, now it's time to heal. Yep. I let him punch me one too many times. You know what? I don't give a fuck as long as I have this. And then, you know what? And then some. Before he's... 
Ooh, ooh. Dodge jail for fuck's sake. There we go. That that ice is just too much for him. Stars indeed. What was that C word? Oh, it's okay. I'm very glad you were here. You saw some really cool things, and that that's awesome. Thank you for dropping by. As always, thanks for the support. Have a wonderful day, and hopefully, I see you later. And things possible. Okay, we were stars. Pretty good. You know what? You suck at this. I dodged most of your <laughs> attacks, even though I was just trying to attack myself. Oh, Nami. But now we get to see the the other big guy here. Do, do I want to keep? Yeah, I want to keep this. It's time for another game that I love very much. It's called. It's not called anything, really. I thought it was gonna. Okay, let's do it in the next room. Maybe I was wrong. Maybe it's coming here. So it's time for another game I like. It's called Quake. Yeah. <laughs> There's also one called. Called. Called Quake Two. Oh my god. I thought there were three three tremors. I don't know why I thought that. <laughs> Her strokey face is just phenomenal. She's like, <laughs> Oh, Jill, you just keep falling from things. Okay, this is all about timing. I think you can shoot him to oblivion. Like, no, to obedience. But I think the... As I re recall, the, the only goal is to just, like, flip the switches, open the ladders, because even sewers in Raccoon City are <laughs> puzzle bait. Do it now while he's threatening you. Go! He's just, like, pretending. Go! Go, you woman! Yeah! Yes, thank you. Woohoo! Okay, where's next? There's gonna be a several holes. There's gonna be... Hello, sir? You gonna... Sir? No? Okay, I guess I'll take have to take a bite. I don't know if you can dodge this. Hmm. I kind of hear the rocks. Fuck it. Ra! Ra! Ah! Open up, asshole! Oh, I did everything I wanted. I, I needed to. There we go. It's all the way there. Yes. You can bite me again, but I have the herbs. Suck. Oh, I also have the nemesis. Ah! Ah! Twice. Oh, that's not good. Okay. Wow, defeated by a fucking worm after all that. No first aid sprays because we don't do those in the old games. <laughs> Fuck you, I have the ladder! Yes, he can't touch me while I'm on the ladder. <laughs> Damn, he does some damage, you gotta be prepared for that. I thought he was gonna be like easier than Nemesis. Just clips you twice. And there we go, manhole open. Yeah, we were here. Is there gonna be... I think there's gonna be a dog or something now here. I saved that barrel in case there's a rabble. Barrel for a rabble. A rabble rabble. Hello? There's nothing here. I saved it for nothing. Okay, let's blow it up for our satisfaction. Shaboom! And run for good luck. And then active reload. Wee! One shell, that's just... <laughs> I love that, just... Like, fire seven shells is like... Shk, ready, <laughs> ready for action. <laughs> no logic whatsoever. So, sorry for your boss. Sorry for the loss of your boss. Hello, sir, you still there? Pain and suffering. That's another game. That's like, that's another game. We'll get to that one, too. No, this is Resident Evil. Anyone here? I just want to check. Kind of needed, like, seemed like you guys needed help. No? Okay. Then, well, let's just go. Hi, Mikhail. <laughs> I can't see you if I'm not <laughs> in your face. Uh, let's put the fuse in. Bleep. Power on. And let's put the mixed oil in. And get ready for more cinematics. There we go. Jill the mechanic. Carlos, I'm sorry about Murphy, but there was nothing you could have done. Yeah, you're right, Jill. I'll operate the cable car. I mean, you fixed it. At least uh, what I, at least I can at least <laughs> drive it. Come on, 
Let's go. So wherever Jill goes, uh, uh, Carlos's teammates die and his boss and all that, but he's still like, yeah. <laughs> I mean, she did fix the car, so we can at least like drive it, which is again a trolley, so like a tram, so it should be you know self-driving. But <laughs> thanks for the help, Carlos. I will have those like two minutes of rest <laughs> while I keep saving your butts. Yes, run for that control board. Push the lever. Yes. I mean, it's complicated. I it's know you good. can do it. <laughs> what is looking good? Oh, I took down half the house with laughter. Like, are you fucking kidding me? So you just look at the dashboard. It's looking good. <laughs> it's a nice dashboard. I've I've seen one ones like this one. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> I can't. This is just too fun. Let me just point at him and gesture with my hand. No, Jill, you go definitely. <laughs> I am piloting the fucking hey, trolley here. The no, I'll check. No worries, gentlemen, sir. <laughs> Jill will check for you. You know what? I'm gonna kill him. I know you can kill him or run. He can't do shit to me. Like I will just fucking kill him. I think I can kill him. I mean, I'll look at you and then at the towering monster that's in front of you. Just like, what was he doing? Tying his shoelace over there? Ah, don't run. Just fuck him up. He'll be perpetually stunned. There we go. And then again. Oh no. No again. Not again. Fuck you for killing my Mikhail. Oh, he's getting the sloshy hand. Here we go. Get out of the cable car now. <laughs> yeah. Don't! Never! <laughs> oh. Precious. Just precious. <laughs> yeah, the raid launcher and all that didn't work. I'm gonna shoot you with never gun. <laughs> Obviously, not planning a trap. Why don't we have those grenades? What You couldn't have given me a few, you asshole, before you killed yourself. I could have used that. I could have used that really well. Huck a grenade and them, just watch them fly. Jesus, these people, no wonder you failed. And now this asshole can even operate a brake. Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh, boy. What are we going to do? Jump out or brake? Quickly, if you want to vote, we have a few... S hmm... You know what? These men are just useless. I'm gonna be Rambo here and jump out. Fuck you, Carlos. You're useless. She agrees! <laughs> perfect. Just perfect. Oh, goodbye, Carlos. <laughs> I think she meant to say he's useless, but she was nice. She was like, it, it's useless. Goodbye. Like Scott Pilgrim. No, Jill. No bad sounds, Jill. <laughs> uh, yeah, definitely. Michael Bay versus Cathedral. <laughs> oh, my head hurts from falling off the fucking exploding tram. How did she end up at the same... She jumped out of a tram that was moving, out of a moving tram, and she just landed right next to it. And not even in the fire where she can hurt... She can't even hurt herself in the fire. Okay, yeah, this is Jill's the Terminator. At this point, yeah, Nemesis doesn't stand a cha chance. <laughs> Jill's just gonna take whatever he throws at her. Eat it and spit it back at him and scream, Never! Oh yeah, now uh, more assholes gonna... Is there like a door that's destroyed? It's, just, it's worth it, playing this game just for these things. I love it. I love it so much. Hello, what's this? Oh, there we go. Is it Carlos? No. But zombies, you know, they... Fire grenade launcher will take them out, but let's try to cool them out with the fucking cooling thing. Let's see what that does. Hello, sirs. Do you need to cool down a bit? Yes, I went to Schwarzenegger School of One-Liners. Please, step away from the chopper. What I mean is a trap. Stop it. I'm trying to save you to cool you down. Blah, blah. Blah. What? They're still on fire? It makes no sense! 
This is a lie. This is just one gigantic lie. Oh my god, I just shot fucking liquid nitrogen at them. Somehow made it first from... It's possible, actually. Unknown, you know, it's possible. Somehow I made liquid nitrogen rounds. Let's check, yeah. Freeze rounds. It's gonna tell us what they are after we find more, but I'm pretty sure it's loaded with nitrogen. Somehow made from uh, gunpowder. <laughs> at shot it at flaming zombies and they just don't give a shit <laughs> clock t t clock t key the mr t clock t key okay so check around the what shaped object round shape okay yeah it looks like a winding key i think that's what it is after you assemble it any files seriously you're you're Cutting me on files here. I'm pretty sure I missed something, which will just be so annoying because I used to be able to get all the files here just without thinking. I knew where they are. Now it's like, but I like it because it's like, kind of like it's been so long that I feel it feels fresh again, and I lo love that. And it's so much fun. It's still, I don't know, it's so <laughs> useless. Fuck you, Carlos. <laughs> oh, so good. So, uh, spray, that's, we don't use that here. It's shameful to even use all these herbs I did. Uh, yeah, we need more seas, definitely. Will I need a lighter here? I somehow remember I will. Or a clock pick, maybe? Fuck it. A clock pick, please. I'm in the clock tower. It has to be a clock pick. Charge! Ooh, ooh, ooh. I just love that stun sound. Really? No files here either? Maybe everything's kind of shuffled because I did the route. I did two or three things the opposite way that I normally do them. The gem, the the order of which I get the trolley thing items, and it's different. I, there, I, I'm so glad I got to see the different cutscene with uh, Carlos having to kill Murph or Murphy. I've used the winder key, I have. So it's like a key and a winder key. Obsession. <laughs> and we've also seen uh, Nikolai explode, and now we've <laughs> jumped through the window. Oh, there he is. Fuck you! Carlos. Yeah, let's look at each other until we recognize each other's well, faces. We to <laughs> you didn't, buddy, but again. okay. <laughs> Sure, let's rest. Here's a gift for you. Oh, what are you giving me? Tell me it's freeze rounds and I love you. But yeah, cover the hand that's holding the item. You don't want to do that technically. Oh, okay. I promised I I'd love him. I have to love him now. Thank you. I love you. I love you. Bye. -bye. Oh, he likes it. Yeah, he didn't even he didn't want to ruin it. You want to say anything? So let's check them now. Thank you, Carlos. You just solved two problems. Bullet? They're not bullets, but okay. Warhead. Okay, heavy words. Heavy words. Ultra low temperature liquid nitrogen. So many words. I think a lot of that is untrue, but okay. There must be some files here. Come on, don't skim on those files. Old books are scattered here. With nothing suspicious here. Or here. Oh, there's a file. Finally, a file. Art picture postcard. A picture postcard of antique clocks. The following verse is printed. Give your soul to the goddess. Put your hands together to pray before her. We did that in Resident Evil 2. You and your goddesses, like Raccoon City, it has the most goddesses ever. Like the flying goddess, the time goddess, the Dutch goddess, the unicorn goddess, the... Flying fuck goddess, I don't know. The music is awesome though. I love it. I think it's one of those that's only here. Or maybe later when you get rescued. Really? No. I mean, I am overloaded with bullets, but there. The god of time is etched under the keyhole. 
Kronos, the god of time. Are we like switching games again? Let's load that in. <laughs> and go into the scary part. Oh wait, the spiders. Do I want to freeze the spiders or burn them? I kind of feel they would hate burns more, but I have no flame grenades. Oh yeah, this too. Hello. Okay, this is the this is the right one. So it's the one that is dude dude udu udu okay it's udu udu but let's let's give dude dude the chance maybe he plays something better for us who knows maybe the guy practiced him stick his table yeah oh wait is there something this guy will have something valuable I'm pretty sure like a file let's check that and then give <laughs> Do, do the chance. Yep. Operation instruction. This is gonna be like written by a snobby umbrella boss. Order for the UBCS Echo team. Wipe out the downtown area of the infestation and then evacuate the re remaining citizen to the clock tower. Among the civilians, remember to give priority to the employees of Umbrella's affiliates. Remember to stay alert because the infected have a high endurance rate and will strike without hesitation. Evacuation procedure. 1. Once the mission is complete or when it becomes too impossible, too impossible to accomplish, evacuate immediately. 2. We'll deploy a helicopter that is waiting in the suburbs to the yard in front of the clock tower. 3. When you are ready for evacuation, ring the bell of the clock tower to signal the helicopter. You've taken the operation, manifestation, whatever. A mercenary's corpse. He might have died fighting. Definitely didn't die reading comics, I can tell you that. The map is okay, I guess. Okay. No. Okay, we have enough of those. Fuck them. Let's see what Dude Dude has to say. Oh, disgusting. No, no. You need to practice, man. So, Udu Udu for the win. It's actually, it's actually better if I pronounce it in English. It's Dud Dud. It is a Dud. It's a Dud melody. Anything here? Hello? Look, look at all this space and no items. I feel cheated, but it's wonderful. So another excuse for the, for a Spencer mansion -y location, I guess. That's what the clock tower is. At least what that's what I that's what I think. Um, it's pretty. Oh, nice. It's pretty, you know. Victorian old. It feels like houses and whatever were last decorated like this back in the 70s but now we're in raccoon city a very prosperous and forward-thinking town with millions of people and subways and huge companies and everything but you know we still like our interior decoration and the style of the three centuries back do i wanna i wanna acid those no wait i wanna save that for the hunters but hunters hate cold cold too Fuck it, I'll find more of these anyway, so yeah. That's for the spiders. Why not? Why the hell not? Alrighty. Charge, Jill. <laughs> Everybody can die here but Jill, apparently. Maybe they also have save games like we what we saw. Nikolai blew up, he just blew up, he just like said, fuck it, I'll just use my save. I want to confront the spiders, kind of. Let's do that. You know what? I don't want to confront the spider. Go, come back! Oh, I kind of feel I shouldn't have done that. Ugh, he's gonna, like, spoil my journey here. Spiders? There they are. Okay, because you're high up, I'll give you a special something. 
for high up spiders. Cool. Oh no, when I do that, the little babies come out. I forgot. Step on the babies. Step on the baby. Ow. Step on the baby. Ow. Step on. Oh, wait. I have to do that while they're there. Can I do it? No. Aim for the thing, Jill. Yeah. Fuck yeah, that was satisfying. Fuck the baby. Oh. Ow. Baby spiders. Fuck them all. Ow. Fuck you, bitches. Okay, uh, they're gonna despawn but i did what i came to do i fucked myself over a bit possibly but it's worth it for blowing up two spiders with one explosive device maybe i should have saved it for nemesis we'll find out i don't even need these explosive rounds <clears throat> so what was i doing before i killed the spiders let's go outside i guess or, or actually let's go here because that's where we can unlock the, the other door from i think yeah. Let's go there first to the dining room, I think. <clears throat> Barry's not here this time to go. What is? Th oh, hello, Mr. Crawley. What do I have? Shotgun. Yeah, why not? You know what? You deserve something special. Shaboom! Three grenades at once, yeah. Are you standing or crawling, sir? They're all crawlies. Can I get... Can you, like, bunch up? I want to see if I can get two of you with one. Where's the other one? I kind of hear him, but I don't see him. Can I even... Oh, I think he's there. I can't see now. Can't. Do, do I want to risk it? No, there he is. I can do both. Come on. Come on, Jill. Just in between them. Oh, why are you alive? You ate like a grenade round. Gee, Crawlies are really strong. Okay. Let's not fuck with those guys again. Yes. Just keep them coming. <laughs> There's nothing in the fireplace. You know what? I've been tricked by that before, Jill, but I pretty much remember no use for lighter here until the pumpkin cottage, as I like to call it. Maybe something on the table? The dining table? This is like the best cathedral I've ever seen. You know, I, I want to see this cathedral. It would have been nice to see this in the remake. Like this candlestick and all that. It, somehow somehow we don't get to see like the... Yeah, we got Resident Evil 1 remake, sure. But we don't get to see all that stuff in the new engine. That kind of bothers me. But you know what? Maybe I, should, maybe I shouldn't say that. Like I don't want to see RE1 remade like, with missing half the mansion. Or something like that. No, thank you. Open a Z-lock. Is he gonna... I think something's gonna bust in here, I know that. Oh no, not this time, I guess. Do you wanna play the piano? Maybe I need to provoke them. Hello? Don't barricade the windows or anything, Jill. Stars member. Okay, creepy music just decreepified. Let's see, there should be some bees here. Not bees, I mean bee gunpowders. There's a typewriting machine for typewriting and there are sitting benches for sitting and there's a pipe organ for piping oh yeah okay it's cc with grenade rounds isn't it or is it c with grenade? oh let's check that i don't want to make more acid rounds or something i don't need so let's do this <laughs> I know you're waiting for me to fail, you dirty bastard. I w I will check that. I don't wanna I don't want another acid round fiasco. I'm sure. You know what? I'm not even sure that. I'm, I was gonna say I'm sure it's C, but it could be like Z. So let's check. Alrighty. What was it? Uh, reloading to gun gunpowder. It should be yeah. It's in my history gunpowder so combinations with the with grenade grenade rounds combination okay oh it doubles them that's the thing so it is well that's actually cool so normally you need cc so that's two b two a's two b's to get a CC, right? Combine those and you get 10 free rounds by default, right? 
but if you combine C with a, with six grenade rounds, you get six freeze rounds. Or like CC with six with six grenade rounds, you get twelve freeze rounds. That math is kind of not working, but still. So CC, what was it? Is it CCC for like the ultimate? Six of them? Really? I didn't notice that. So I'm just making grenade rounds out of nothing. Is that what you're telling me? Well, let's let's take a look at that again. Uh, somehow feels too easy. Is it just me or does it feel too easy? Scratching my head about this. Yeah, it's just like add C's to grenade rounds and you get freeze rounds. And kind of seems, according to this, you get a lot more. So let's see. Let's see what we can see with the CC. Let's not fuck it up. Focus. So 47. What the fuck just happened? I got 26. Okay, yeah. I mean, Nemesis doesn't stand. No, nothing stands a chance. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, it's not this easy on hard mode, I'm sure. I'm, I'm definitely sure because that's the most recent one I played. And I remember it wasn't really... It wasn't peachy running through with just pistol for a while. <clears throat> around this time I'd switch to shotgun and here I'm running around with the freeze rounds. Okay. Be bezel key? What's a bezel? Sounds familiar though. No. Wrong thing. This is not Resident Evil 2. Combine is second. Wait, no? Not yet? Oh, I'll need some kind of a chain or something. Right. Altar. Which... How do you even get to the other side? Never mind. It was there just for you. Whoop! I kind of definitely fucked up by trying to climb the stairs. And now the asshole is going to be after me. And I'll fight him. Because I have all of this shit. I didn't collect all this just to, like, escape from one nemesis. But I will be smart. Actually, there should be herbs outside. Fuck it. Risk it all. I don't want to use these herbs. I don't feel like using them. And then I exit and it's going to be just, like, five zombies. In the fire? Maybe we need to cool them down again. Stars, maybe? Yeah, that music screams stars. Oh no, it's not stars, so they're not even burning. Okay, let's let's shotgun the whole bunch. Yeah, all right, that was easy. <laughs> Thanks for duping me. So did ne did Nemesis like tell them to get in here? Was he like stars get in there and spook her and I'll swoop in and just get her? We wanna yeah, we're not fighting it yet. There's gonna be crows outside as far as I can remember. Oh, a nice key lock. I don't remember that detail. Oh, it's the dogs. Hello, Cerberi. I can hear you. I don't have the never gun, so let's call them both. No, don't dodge. Shoot them. Fuck, that'll kill you, Jill. Don't dodge them. Shoot them. <laughs> oh, now you're loading. Oh, nice. That's my. That's on me. Ah, I dodged and I got bitten? I call bullshit. But still I won, so why would I complain? You bit my leg. My... For some reason, like, for October weather, pretty naked leg. I can hear the wind, Joe. I'm freezing. Why are you not freezing? Yes, take all the blue herbs, you... Hopefully you won't need to use them. Jeez. This is a cathedral, right? What would like... Is there... Our cathedral has priests, right? I'm not really... I don't know how it goes in like the Catholic. Sash? Cathedral has priests in it, right? They're like... Or some... Like... Pastor or something. Why would they keep so many green herbs here? What was going on here? I mean, it's a nice place to hang out. There's nobody there in the evening. Maybe just had parties until we like literally crashed in here with the fucking tram. 
took down oh there's a door there i didn't notice that so that was probably the, the front entrance i think let's check the map because you can see yeah where the tram got in so the save room on the east on the right side where i got in <coughs> pardon me that's uh that was a priest's bedroom or something we kind of clipped into that just bef just south of the safe room yeah we opened that room and on the other side of the tram i don't know how this works i know it makes more sense when you use the emergency brake because you end up here i think and carlos ends up there and it kind of makes more sense what is that is there a person oh no it's just uh architecture i kind of look from here yeah they're wearing something oh it's this oh it's this is covering them this little rusty bull thing so over here you can clearly see it's like silver sculpture and over here like what is that Ada? No, it's not. It is not Ada. Oh, it's pretty boring here. No dogs instead of crows. Everything's different than I remember. I guess that's it. Nothing else. We gotta go upstairs and you know face our greatest fears. Get our escape blown off from the sky and all that so it was it was udu udu yeah the dud dud was the dud i like five steps i kind of i was kind of disappointed always annoyed me in resident evil 2 is the only one i think maybe survivor but not sure about that i know two for definitely has only three steps upside uh, upstairs are you kidding me leon and claire what are you like Skipping five steps at a time makes no sense. Resident Evil 1 takes five steps, 3 takes five steps. Now the latter steps, that's different I think in every game. There was four, there was five, there was six. Clink, clink, we're gonna count these now, yeah. Ooh, okay, this is a time to vote if you want, guys. So now, now there will be two choices here. We can blind Nemesis and push him off the building, or, or we can electrocute him. So you guys who are here, feel free to vote. Lights the hour plate of the clock. Yeah. Oh, nice. Yes, mixtures. And we're going to have a, a safe room up there. So, Ah, oh, you can't mix them here. God damn it. Why in the name of ass can you not mix the earth? You know what? Oh, wait. I will use one of these. Yeah, that's. I don't think I need that one anymore. Blind is more fun. Yeah, he, she just tackles him. He's like a ton, weighs a ton, and she's like, Ugh! but she can open a door. Yes, okay, I'll be able to come by. Nice. I don't have to sacrifice anything. Come on, Jill. She's so short, short sighted. So we're blinding him. Okay, that's what we're doing. Combine, combine again, Jill. It's right there. Oh, fuck. oh. She should have gotten glasses before, you know. Maybe she was pretending she doesn't need them because she's stars, so they would like, you know, would make her fear, uh, make her look bad in front of the team. So she's like, ah, yeah, I can see perfectly. Let's count. Four. Pour in this one, okay. More gunpowder, because the priests just love their gunpowder. Let's do this. So, Udu Udu it is. <laughs> I love this melody. And I know my sister loves it a lot. One of my sisters. Uh, she always... Uh, insisted that I call her when I play this part <laughs> when I was a kid just so she could listen to the melody way before YouTube and all that where you could just find and play it so up it's already up okay up next is down Udu. wait what's going on switch a no next next Udu, and then U again. Udu. That's it. Udu, Udu. Yep. Udu, Udu. Here we go. 
So end. Wait, play it for fuck's sake. Oh, tell me it didn't reset. Maybe just plays it and that's it. That's it, definitely. Open sesame! Seriously? I guess next, 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 next. U, D, U. Oh, that's right. U, D, U. Well, U, D, U, U, D, U. No, it's okay. Play it. I guess the angel has to scan them. Like, are you all properly aligned? I opened the puzzle box thingy for you. Yep, that's it. <laughs> the angel have had spoken. Oh, Chronos Chain. Yes! Yes! I like time-based puzzles that have nothing to do with time, but they just mention time deities. I love that. No, I really do. A chain made to a door, a god of time. There's a small screw hole near the... Okay, Jill, that you keep that for you and Carlos. I don't want to know about your screw hole. Okay. Combine with the winder key. <laughs> winder up. And we get the Kronos key. It's a key designed to adore a god of time. But that's all. Not No s smart comments. Let's not go down there. This machinery is useless, I guess. This is full. What's this? I see something shiny here. It's the silver gear. Oh my, quite. Okay, item box time, item box time, item box time. Oh yeah, well, I gotta make the full cog gear thingy. See, if those priests didn't use so much green herbs, so many green, so many green herbs? Hmm, maybe you can put it in the plural as so much green herb. That's what I meant. Um, no, you probably can't. They wouldn't have left two pieces of the puzzle of the same cog split. So one, two, three, four, and we have these. <clears throat> you know what? He's not gonna fight me until I go do the puzzle and come back, as far as I remember. Knowing that... Knowing that... I want to put some acid rounds here because there's going to be more spiders down there, I think. And the last time I used grenade rounds for some reason. So... Yes. That's it. It's cog time. Let's push the bastard from the balcony. Oh wait, there's more things to pick up. That's right. Yay! More gunpowder. More. Jim. Jillix. Jim? Excuse me. <laughs> Jill explodes! Her life is not shit. Well, it is. She's surrounded by very incompetent people everywhere she goes. Guy couldn't even, like... I prepared the tram for you. You couldn't even drive it, Carlos. You suck. I don't know what she sees in him other than the accent. Which is what he says at the start. So he was right. And she had no rights to be mad at him. And yet, she's the one who's gonna slap him later. Yeah, I remember that. It was my, one of my favorite scenes when I was a kid. Just the moment when she slaps him so hard, I think my face hurts from it. It was so, like, full, full open pot. Like, blah. <laughs> Smack in the face. I wonder if that's gonna happen with, uh... Uh, with this setup. Okay, uh, pushy from the balcony. Yeah, let's push him. I can use doors, bitch. Stars. stars. Everything goes to negative. Uh, use the light, definitely. Wow. Let's give him a few more seconds. Run. Fuck you. Uh, I'm blind. I can't see. I'm a bio, super bio weapon, but light is my one. Oh, Ignis. I like to think how he 
left like a wily e. coyote imprint at the bottom there. Where is this even falling? Let's go check that. I wonder if he leaves a wily e. coyote imprint. This should be. So I pushed him here. It should be. Oh, you can't even. You can't zoom this. Yeah, it's unzoomable. Unlike up, down, downtown, left time. Yeah. So this one's unzoomable. Ah! This one is unzoomable. So. <laughs> yeah. See you later. Uh, he would fall in front, so where I was fighting the dogs. Let's see if he's there, or if he left a wily e. coyote imprint in the ground. Like, either of those is good. Oh, you Jill, you just turned on one light and you fucked it up. How? How do, how do you... How do you fuck up a, a light switch by turning a light on? It's just, just in Resident Evil. I guess it's like a fair chance you get to blind him once. Not again. Charge! No spiders, no. Charge! Charge. Imagine if, it, if instead of stars, he went around screaming whenever he charges, he goes, Charge! Charge! <laughs> yeah, like the boomers from Gears of War. I love their entrance. One of the best video game enemy entrances ever. When they just appear out of nowhere and go, boo, through the walls. That just deep, bassy, boo. I can't even do it properly. It needs, like, amplification. Let's try it. Boo. I wonder what it's going to sound like in, in later. Ah, <laughs> oh, nothing there. He must have fallen here. Unless he fell, like, on the roof of this thing, like, over there. But that shouldn't be the case. I feel disappointed. Where is my wily e. Coyote imprint? Poppycock. Okay, then back to the other thing. What were we doing again? Yeah, the chrono something like puzzle. Escape the city. God knows, I'm not even following anymore. To the puzzle room. As soon as we open the door. Dum dum. Dum dum. The Kronos key is no longer useful. Discarded. Yes, discarded like yesterday's paper. Quite. I don't know why I'm using this accent today. I'm accent? Accent today. I'm kind of feeling it. Let's acid up some spiders so they can't, like, leave their baby spiders lying around. Fuck you! Yep, no babies from acid, bitch. You come here. Come here and fight me. Fool. Is there another one? Yeah, I hear him. Oh, it's down now. Don't spit, don't spit! There we go. Acid, bitch. Ooh, I like how they change their color after you kill them with acid, and then they keep doing that, like real spiders. If you ever tap the spider, like on your table or somewhere, that's what they do. Even though, by all laws of science, these guys wouldn't be able to move. Like, they, it wouldn't work, but it does in Resident Evil, and that's why we love it. Oh, what do you have there? Grenades rounds. Thank you, sir. You couldn't have just, like, use them? I think this is... Not, it wasn't Twisted Metal. It was this sentence. And I played Twisted Metal for two or three years already when I played this. It was this sentence that I learned the word Twisted. Because it was like, why? He's not a car. Why is he Twisted? Oh, that's what it means. I was a kid. Forgive me. So nothing there. Damn, on easy everybody had ammo, but nobody used it. On hard, nobody had ammo. It makes more sense people are dead, because they're not just like... They, they don't die with a fucking atomic bomb in their pockets. Oh, this is a sad one, I remember this. Let's give him a dignified voice. September 26th! It's only been three hours since the mission started, but the team is down to me and Campbell. He's a... Uh, this, he's a young guy, he's a teenager, he gave his life for Umbrella, and you know, he's one of those that were taken. So I believe this is what his voice would sound like. This is a real dramatic reenactment, so please, contain your feelings till the end. The number of zombies so far is gra greater than we expected. There is no hope less left for this city. We have already injected the antibody for the virus, but I'm not sure if that'll work. That it will work. I don't know if I will survive. September 27th. We managed to reach the clock tower. 
Out of desperation, we robbed some wounded members of their weapons and used the surviving citizens as decoys. We were taught to do this in order to survive in the battlefield, but I never enjoyed it. However, a girl showed up at the clock tower before me. She is one of the survivors. She looks just like my sister before she starved to death. September 28th. This is making me feel bad for choosing this voice for this file. Let's say he matured in one day. September 28th. I wanted to evacuate as soon as possible, but the girl didn't. Her father insisted that he wouldn't leave the city where his beloved wife rests in peace. I really wanted to save the girl, but Campbell said, All I care about is our lives. Our lives. Our lives. That's how I felt before, but now I forgot to finish the sentence. The clock tower has become a dangerous place, and I don't want to make any more mistakes. And that's the last entry. It's a pretty sad... Sorry? He did mature in a day. Merc's pocketbook. That's one of the saddest files in RE3 for me. To shield someone's daughter. And that, like, I remember how that blew my mind. She just read it in the file, and she's informing me now. She's aware of what happened. It was... It's a step down from solving the Vigil puzzle in Resident Evil 1 only after you've read the file explaining how to do it, but still pretty good. Nice furniture, great music, I love this music, and now it's time to do this puzzle that I never understood. If anybody understands how the fuck this works, please tell me. So here we have Past Goddess, there is a tray under the picture, okay, that's Past. Present Goddess, Past, Present, Future, makes sense, right? Future is... Apparently that, uh, that's what it is for everyone, somehow, but, I mean, that's life, but you don't have to tell me that game, jeez, I came here to, like, watch, you know, other things die. There is a tray under the picture, okay, so, like, from baby to a weirdo, and then to a skeleton. Basically telling us life is shit, I guess? Your life is shit! Nothing here, oh yeah, I forgot about this. Eh! Come on. A spare bell for the clock tower. It would take incredible strength to move it. I can do it. So apparently, you can knock a fucking... <laughs> That's nice. Nice touch. You can, you can knock Nemesis off the building with a sh shoulder tackle. You can fucking shoulder tackle a rusty metal door to open. But you can't move one bell. You need a man for that. So inconsistent. Uh, McDowell and Mary? Huh, that's interesting. You'll tell me about it. You'll tell me more about it. I'm interested in such stories. Seriously, f f like killing File 3, that hurts me. Oh, that hurts me more than turning, you know, Code Veronica into a side game. Tricking us all. Oh, th this fit well with, like, being a Resident Evil main game wait maybe these statues are supposed to tell me who's whom so over here we have like no it's not telling me anything i'll just try to do it a maiden statue so this is like a bronze woman she has a yellow thing on her forehead let's see the details she's a maiden amber she's got the amber ball so amber came from let's call her amber okay Okay, let's try to solve this with logic and not just like pushing them in. Then we have a brownish girl with a silver thing on her forehead. Interesting. Holding an obsidian ball. So silver one is obsidian. Makes no sense. Let's see further. And then we have a bluish girl with a still silverish thing on her forehead. Going like, oh, who? A maiden statue holding a tray, a crystal ball. Crystal ball kind of sounds like the future. Amber sounds like past, because it's, you know, where you find fossils. This is just me thinking. It should be, but then again, I don't get this. I never understood this puzzle. I just do it. I don't think there's a, there, maybe there's, a, it's not even a puzzle. It's just like... You're not telling me much. Well, let's start with Amber. I think they should all stop at midnight. 
sure. And then let's put obsidian into the present because I don't know. The present is dark at the moment. Okay, and then future is the silver one, crystal one. Because, you know, crystal ball looking at the future kind of makes sense. Yeah! Yes! Yes! Kind of made sense. When I did this last time on the hard difficulty, it made no sense. I spent 15 minutes here just like shuffling them. Maybe I messed up somehow, but... Okay, since we can't push the thing... We are going to load a bit longer, which is okay. Get the guild gear, a guild, a guild gear. And then, combine, oh, I didn't check, fuck it, never mind. After the god of time, himself, a oh, quite. What do we have here? Freeze round, you know what? I think that's all we'll need from now on. I don't think there's gonna be any more, like regular enemies for a while, and even then, after this point, it's redundant carrying the shotgun. It's literally unnecessary. Just I'll have so many grenade and freeze and acid and bassid and lucid rounds. It's just insane. I won't need it. Hello, picture. Not gonna comment on it. Jill was like, she filled her art, uh, you know, the she capped her art appreciation at the um, Spencer Mansion. She's not commenting on that shit anymore. Like, a fireplace. <laughs> I've seen quite a few of those. <laughs> Alrighty. So we should end it somewhere here. I'm wondering if it's more climatic to end it than... Um... Very nice. Thank you for that. I'm interested in that. Thank you, Unknown. I appreciate it. See, stories like that would be really cool. I read a lot about Mickey, so I really wish they included the day in Raccoon. I think that's the most missed one, but that's really, really neat. What was I saying? Uh, yeah, is it more, is it better to end it with the Nemesis battle and, and save after that, or just save before the Nemesis battle now and start the next stream with the Nemesis battle? What do you think, Unknown, huh? Well, we go up the ladder. You think about that. You think about that hard, young man. Oh, ladders. Oh, okay. So, I, I hope you thought about it. Should we end it with a Nemi battle here or not? Or, or start with a Nemi battle? For an explosive ending. Okay. Let's do it. Then, let, then we fill in full of whatever we have here. We don't need those anymore. <laughs> never gun. Oh, is there a way to make ammo for never gun? That would be really, really cool. Let's keep these. Actually, make room. So first health. I will want one anti poison. I think these two will be enough. I'll just like, yeah, more than enough. I'll just fill him with the freezy thingy, and he's gonna go ooh, 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 ooh. But also one of the best cutscenes in the game, for sure. <laughs> you know what? You make that, and I'll just copy off of you. <laughs> You're so smart and all. Get ready. Here we go. Sad cutscene. Ahoy! Cutscene. Pretty much. Showing 2020. I seen that uh, a couple months ago. It was awesome. Oh, it's not gonna start until I exit. Okay. We're not saving. We are like, we're very ballsy. I am very positive Jill can do this with, you know, with just the, these herbs. We have the freeze thingy. Just fucking punch him. I actually heal punch. I'll just fill him with this and it'll, it'll go down pretty quick. Like, ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah, I'm not even gonna mix the blue. I'm just gonna use it for. I think you can't see your condition, that's the thing, because of the virus, they just go purple and go wild. Oh, it's not starting until I open the door, right? Yeah. The sound is superb. This is PlayStation 1. It had very limited sound capabilities for today's console. This is top-notch. Now I nip on down there to the front. 
Hello, Chopper. Rescue. Obviously the end of the game. I was duped the first time. I was like, yeah, I finished the game. There we go. Yay! Booms! Yay! Oh. The painful expression in that second. <laughs> yeah. Deny. Ooh, hello, beautiful. That painful, like, brief second when she holds her head in pain, it tells you everything. And very good voice acting. Dodge, and then suddenly she won't be able to dodge. Oh, yeah, you, there's no dodging that. She went right through her chest, yet somehow her shoulder is. Oh, are we fighting? Or, yeah, Carlos is gonna give him the heebie jeebies. Oh, no, we're fighting. Ah! I'm not ready! Yeah, dodge for dodge, bitch. Ah, you suck. Oh, straight in my face! Just fill and fool. Yeah, there we go. What is my state? It's virus. I am virus. You know what? Not even close. Ah, that missed! Okay, now it's time for that... You know what? Fuck yeah. He probably didn't take any health, but mm, I want to go go to sleep healthy. You see? Like, wow! Did you see that? I never saw the tentacle go like... Was that a bug or shit? Like, what? Give me back my gun parts! Why are you walking into the fire? <laughs> Perfect bioweapon. Masterpiece. <laughs> Asshole. <laughs> Uh, Jill, you won. You don't have to do anything. Yeah, rest. You earned it. <laughs> they should be sad, but it's like one woman taking down the whole city of zombies. And there he is. Like, uh, Did you just jump Jill, over Nemesis' co corpse? I will shake you more. That must I'm help. Sorry, <laughs> Please, wake Did you see that too? Yeah, that's how it works, Carlos. You weren't there when you needed... You could do this co-op, you Jill. stupid fuck. <laughs> yeah. I love this. I woke up to the sound of falling rain. I can't believe I'm still alive. Nobody can believe that, Jill. It's like, it's literally impossible. Improbable, impossible, undoable. You're the best. <laughs> oh, it's vibrating. What are you doing there, Carlos? What are you Carlos. doing there, Step Carlos? It looks like our roles have been reversed from when we originally met, huh? What you were infected Don't and worry, beaten Jill. by Nemesis? This no. Is safe. Why? <laughs> Why exactly? Virus, I? Hey, oh, you can feel like the vibrations when she's like fighting it. I'm okay. Don't feel any pain, but that's what bothers me. If I can't feel anything, then what does that mean? It means you're don't on drugs. You, you had too many green herbs. That's what it means. <laughs> Whatever you do, don't let that virus beat you. Yes, just like fight it. Like go, and it's not gonna get you. Hello, Carlos. Are you slower, faster? I can't remember. Is these star stats any different, or am I playing too much outbreak? <gasps> We have the never gun. Yeah, an infinite thingy. If I turn into a zombie, don't hesitate. I want your word <sighs> that you'll kill me. Oh, uh, that's not going to happen. You survived this far. If you turn into a zombie, I'll, I, no. <laughs> Take care of her as soon as possible, okay? Now it's here. Oh god, the rain sounds are amazing. I'm getting the chills. I hope we have more never gun ammo, because that's the only thing we'll have here. He does have the pistol too, which it's the plastic one. So you know what? I'm gonna do what I never did. I'm gonna use the fucking pistol. I'm that badass. Knife? No, I'm not that badass. This should go well if I do it like... Damn it. If I do it like... This. Then this. Then this. Yes. Yes, quite. And that's it. Oh, Carlos, you and your inventory. 
Okay, let's save here. Let's start with the pew pew pistol, because I want to see. I remember it was like a Zig or something. Check. Zig Pro SP2009. It's mainly made of plastic and very light. It uses 9mm parabellum rounds. Alright. I think it has like... I don't remember. It has some different stats, but I don't know. Woohoo! Okay, that's an inappropriate, Carla. She's dying over there and you're dancing. Really not cool, bro. Let's save our game. We'll save you in a few days, Jill. You can take it. You're the manliest man here. And this time, save to slot 2, because I want to restore my slot 1 save, which was hard mode, and I don't want to think about fucking that up, so... Slot 2. There we go. <clears throat> A chapel. Oh, dear. Whoa. Slow, slow down there, man. Jeez. Alright, folks. Thank you all for watching. Thank you so much for all your participation, Unknown. It's really appreciated. Uh, it's been eventful. <laughs> Uh, next session should be the last, even with my slow pace doing this, like, uh, very, very enjoyable run. I'm pretty sure we're gonna just blow up Raccoon City next time, which will be Thursday. A uh, big hello to Zombie Data We Work, uh, C-Word, and everyone who dropped in and didn't. Until tomorrow, everyone, stay safe. Bye-bye!